The UK's vaccine offer shows that Britain is Ireland's true friend not the European Union, Sammy Wilson, the DUP's Brexit spokesman has claimed. The former Minister of Finance in the Northern Ireland Assembly commented in the newsletter that because the UK is reportedly willing to send millions of vaccine doses to Ireland, it should be clear that Britain is Ireland's true friend. Mr Wilson was speaking following a Sunday Times report that a scheme is being planned to offer 3.7 million Covid jabs to Ireland. The Sunday Times quoted an anonymous cabinet source close to the government, and said this move would be the first time the UK exported vaccines to an EU nation. Mr Wilson said that the UK's move to help Dublin with a shipment of millions of vaccines should make them question who their genuine friends are. Mr Wilson said, first of all, it's not in our interests to have coronavirus rampant in the Irish Republic due to the incompetence of the EU. Secondly, Despite the way in which the Irish Republic has treated Britain throughout the negotiations with the EU, and it continues to treat Britain in the most despicable way, we aren't churlish enough to withhold help if it's available. The third thing is that it'll be interesting to see whether or not the EU, not wanting to have its own ineptitude exposed, tries to find some lame excuse for refusing to allow Ireland to take the vaccine from the UK. My message to the Irish leadership is, first of all, Recognize your real friends are Britain, your real market is Britain, the country that you depend upon is Britain, not the EU. Don't allow yourself to be browbeaten by the EU, who are likely to use you in pursuit of their wider battle with the UK. And recognize that despite the abominable way which you have treated the UK and Northern Ireland in particular over the protocol, unionists in Northern Ireland are bigger than some of the EU-blinded politicians in the Irish Republic. However, the bloc may see this offer as a move by the UK to undermine its own centralised vaccine distribution effort. The UK is winning the race of vaccinating its citizens, leaving the Republic of Ireland and the rest of the EU far behind. The First Minister of Northern Ireland, Arlene Foster, has said that the UK's apparent offer of sharing their jabs with the Irish Republic is a runner. She said, I think it's the right thing that should happen. I think it's a very practical thing to do and I think it should happen and hopefully it will.